Hey, what's up? It's Paul from Guitar World, and today we're going to be looking at a very cool solid state tube emulated design from Blackstar, the Blackstar ID100 TVP head, along with the ID412 cabinet. Let's check it out. Blackstar is well known for making some awesome tube amplifiers, and this series, the ID series specifically, is their solid state design, but with a, a little bit of a twist, it has tube emulation. So the TVP at the end of the 100 TVP is true valve power, and more about that in a bit. By, by engaging the controls, you'll be able to get that beautiful tube response in this solid state amplifier. Looking at the Blackstar ID100 TVP, it looks pretty much like a single channel front end amp, but there's so much more to this amp because on the front panel, if you don't use any MIDI or foot switching, you can save up to 12 presets located over here, one, two, three, four, along with the bank. So, and the different banks are designated by their colors, as you saw, green, yellow, and red. Now, also, the other capability of this particular head is that over here is a USB connection, which allows you to co connect directly to your computer to get even more expandability out of this amp, which uh, if you download the Blackstar's Insider software, you can tweak and reamp your this Blackstar head with up to 128 presets, and you can basically tweak your tone on the fly. The two key features on the Blackstar ID100 are the voice feature and the TVP feature. Starting over here on the left, we have the voice. So as you can see, you have up to six different voicings of this amplifier. So almost like six channels in OD2 and OD1, super crunch, crunch, clean, bright. And you can see just by this rotary control, you get to pick where you want to start off as your bass tone. Of course, you have the obligatory controls of gain, volume, bass, middle, treble, which is typical of any type of amp. And if you move over to the other part of the EQ section, you have also Blackstar's proprietary ISF feature, which is a tone shaping tool that allows you to get more of that British or American sound. And then as you move over here to the TVP section, which is a true valve power, what, how this works in conjunction with the voicing you can see you have your selection of the type of tube that you want, the type of tube response that you're looking for. So if you're familiar with 6L6s, KT88, KT66, EL34, 6V6, and even EL84. So you have a range of different tube voicings that work really great with the voicing of, in the amplifier itself. Another great feature, of course, is the effects section where you have delay, reverb, and of course, modulation. And you can basically sweep through that, through the type, and then of course, control the levels. There's even more deeper editing, of course, once you connect USB to your computer and get really into voicing and tweaking your sounds. Last but not least, you have your master section where you have your resonance control, which handles sort of the low end of it and the presence, which is the high end, and then your overall master volume. I should also add, there's also a manual mode, which allows you to basically skip any of the presets if you're trying to create a new one or just go directly in front of the amp to get your own sound. You hit the manual mode, and automatically you can just start selecting the voicing and use the front panel controls to create a whole new sound. So let me start with the preset over here. And what I've done is I've picked a voice, which is OD1. And then I'm going to show you the range of sounds you can get from the TVP feature of how the amp starts to become alive is the minute I start hitting all the different tube selections. So let's hear the bass tone. As you can see, I have a little bit of, a little bit of delay and reverb on this sound already. So let's take a listen to it.
Now watch the amp come alive when I engage this. <laughs> scroll through each of the tube uh, sounds starting with the KT88 but, and listen to the range of harmonics and dynamics. <laughs> back so you heard the range of tones I got out of the different uh, TVP section from the tube emulation now I'm just gonna use that if I once I pick one that I actually like I can actually want go back to my voicing and just hear it with the different voicings let's just do that real quick <laughs> state design that sounds as close as you're going to get to a tube amplifier with total flexibility in being able to shape your tone through tubes and voicing, the Blackstar ID100 TVP is essential. Definitely check it out. <laughs>